Welcome to our fourth episode of Meghalaya series. In our previous episode, we had visited the beautiful Krangshuri and Fifi waterfalls. Today we are at Shnongpeteng. It is a small village 8 kilometers north of Dauki along the Ungmoth River, which is famous for riverside camping, water sports and crystal clear water. We woke up to this beautiful view of Shnongpeteng. This is the area where we had camped last night on the banks of Ungmuth River. After breakfast, we are going to begin our action packed day. Now we are ready for some water sports activities. The first activity that we are going to do is boating. Ungmuth River, also known as Dauki River, is one of the cleanest rivers of the world. The water is so clear that we can see the bottom of the river. We can also see the shadow of the boat clearly in the water. We even get to see a beautiful waterfall. From here, we move towards the cliff jumping point. As we do not know how to swim, we first tried jumping from a smaller cliff. After gaining confidence, we jumped from the higher cliff. After cliff jumping, we got ready for snorkeling. We got to see many beautiful fishes up close. Snorkeling in such crystal clear water was an amazing experience. Our next activity was kayaking. After completing all the water sports, we decided to take a look from the suspension bridge. The view from the bridge is spectacular and surely a treat for the eyes. The boat actually seems to be floating in mid-air. After such a wonderful experience at Shnong Pedeng, we left for Dauki, which is around 8 kilometers from here. It costs around rupees 800 per boat, which accommodates 3 people at max. It is the same Ummut river which flows through Shnong Pedeng as well as Dauki, and from here it flows towards Bangladesh. The line of pebbles that you can see behind us represents the border of India and Bangladesh. After a memorable evening at Dauki, we 
left for Malin Long, which is the cleanest village in Asia.